Hello. Hello. Thank you very much for joining. I'm Sayaka, your facilitator for today. Nice to nice meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, may I have your name, please? And my name is Paul. Paul? Yeah. Hi. And I'm from Romania. Romania. Hi, I'm Stephanie. Stephanie. I'm half Japanese, half American. Mm -hmm. Steven, and I'm from USA. And today's theme is our Japanese colors, or colors in Japan. In we'll Japanese art pieces, uh, the artist depicts our seasons or things in colors. So let's see how they depict or paint uh, seasons or things in Japan. Okay. So let's go right. to the room, the highlight room. I already have my opinion. Oh, what, <laughs> yeah. what is that? It just seems like it goes on and on and on and on. And when you think it's over, it comes back. Oh, okay. <laughs> A long, exhausting winter. Okay. Yeah, very nice. Yeah. That's how I like it. It's, ooh, for me, it's kind of like life. It's life. Life, yeah. It's about like, you know, in life we have a lot of uh, situation like, mm -hmm. uh, you see, if uh, the tree are a little bit like a uh, you know, wind, you mm -hmm. know, and I think the wind is the, the, our life, daily life, you know, when we, mm -hmm. there, is it yeah, when you get, wind. The, get the wind, uh, and the, the snow, it's kind of like, it's white, you no? Know? Mm -hmm. Some, some can be like, you know, nice things, mm -hmm. you know, uh, which come in our life, but also make us like a, the bending, no? <laughs> like, so I think it's the image of life, it, you know. It can be blessing or obstacles. Yes, yeah. yes, it's both. Of All them. right. Yeah. I definitely think the length of the artwork has something to play into the meaning, as these two have stated. But for me, going back to, I, I don't know, everything about winter reminds me of home in Aomori, because we're known to get lots of snow in the winter, and it lasts for months and months and months, so it's long. but. Something about, you know, pine trees, they're evergreens, and so they last all year long. Mm -hmm. And for me, I really admire the fact that they can do that. And to me, I also see the Japanese people, especially up north or in the countryside, being very perseverant people mm -hmm. and going through the struggles, no matter how long it ha goes, how long it happens. And that kind of reminds me of that. And the winter's cold and dark sometimes, but there's also something very warm and, and kind of romantic almost mm -hmm. to it. So. Excuse me, I have a question. Yes. So please. this is only here for a limited time. Limited right? time, that's so right. So is it set here just for winter? Mm-hmm. So usually we do not display this uh, during summertime or okay. springtime because we value You wanna go with the flow of the of go the season. With the flow of the season, so we value their uh, cycle of the seasons. Oh, nice. So if you come here in springtime, you will see a lot of sakura, yeah. cherry blossom yeah. painting. Okay, so I, I think you will love, oh. love it, love them. So yes. this is winter time only. I really like that about um, the Japanese people, whether it comes to harvesting or artwork, you know, they make sure that it's all in season. And so you really feel like you're diving into the season that's coming upon you. Mm -hmm. And I like that you have, the museum has this up for the winter time. I think it's very appropriate and it just reminds me how Japan really, really has four seasons. They go through it with the seasons mm -hmm. together. We're in the house and we're warm. Mm -hmm. And we're out, we're looking outside at winter. And it's, personally, I would look more back. Okay. Because you can see how cold it is and how how strong winter the snow is this season and you just for me i would just wonder when is this going to end mm -hmm. yeah. yeah yes as steven pointed out uh, we usually had byobu those paintings uh in tatami or in the mm -hmm. room and this was depicted like we saw, we see it from the warm room. That's Maybe on the second story window because uh, we can't see the ground, Maybe. snowy ground here, only the branches and the tree tops. So we see the snow and pine trees and let's walk along the, let's <laughs> along follow the, winter. Follow the winter. And how old do you think this is? 80 to 100 years old. 80 to 100. 
Exactly. Actually, this was really yes. This yeah. was painted oh. in 1908. Wow. Yes. Okay. So a little bit older About than about a hundred. I was going to say a hundred years. Yes. yes. Forty. Must be so delicate. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes. It seems to go on a bit of a downhill to me because if we are mm -hmm. viewing it from a second floor window, mm -hmm. say. Then the tree going. is getting lower, lower means that the elevation is going lower and going then it comes lower. back up at the end and I think it, it is also, in my opinion, kind of an optimistic thing because you couldn't see the end before but now you can and you can see the land. See the land. Mm -hmm. So we all came from China and Japanese people love to enjoy this uh, on tatami sitting so we inside. don't have inside yes so we don't have tatami here uh, but let's try uh, sitting okay yes it actually looks a bit more detailed when you take a step back it mm -hmm. looks more sharpened and so therefore it looks more real and like more of an experience mm -hmm. rather than just gazing at a piece of you know, art, art mm -hmm. what do you think no when we first started the mm -hmm. first thing i said is I step back mm, yes, and look, yes, and when I step back and look, it looks colder. Mm. Yeah. Well, so you... from here, it looks more cold. Even more, colder? Even colder. Oh, really? Because I can see the top of the branches. So from here, I can see the, like the peak top, mm -hmm. and it looks, oh, it's never going to end. <laughs> It will. Yeah. It will eventually. <laughs> I would like to show you a Japanese style garden like mm -hmm. this. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So usually without snow, it looks like this. Yeah. Japanese style garden. The pine trees are very important for Japanese people, and it has a special meaning. So, have you seen this kind of painting before? It's called uh, No Gakudo. It's on. Oh, I saw something. Yes, yes, theater. Traditional Japanese no theater. Yeah. And every no theater has a painting of pine trees because it represents uh, longevity. Mm. Yes, and good luck. So, drawing pine tree has special meaning and it delivers a message of endurance and um, strength. But the last photo you just showed, mm -hmm. the garden here. Yes. It looks like um, a peaceful place to go, mm -hmm. safe. It's yes. Beautiful. And it looks like the rocks are taking you into there into the path, safe zone. Safe zone. Yeah. Follow the follow, follow the, the path, yeah. step and by you, step. Yeah. You come to the safe house. Yeah. What are your colors from your countries? Actually, in, in, in my country, it's, it's like, uh, let's say, it's, mm, the trees are not so, no, not so green. But I mean the green, it's not green like in Japan. Mm -hmm. it is, in Japan, it's really green, no? Mm -hmm. But in Romania, it's more like, a, it's different. Different yeah. green. Mm -hmm. The California doesn't have a winter. No. So, mm -hmm. it's always beautiful green and beautiful flowers mm -hmm. and bright and... Cheerful, colors. cheerful yeah. colors. Thank you. So, how do you like this painting? For me, it's amazing because it shows like a story. A story, um, yes. Yeah, it shows that from like the beginning a... to end. Here, it's blank. Mm -hmm. So maybe summer's ended. Summer's ended. Then you go into winter and then it's a heavy winter and then you think it's over and then it continues and it continues it gets a little softer like you said you know you said the different times different mm -hmm. places you're in a different place but then it comes back and then it's hard again and you're wishing for the winter warmer time warmer time yeah, the so winter it's a story day. Thank you. Mm. Oh, beautiful story, but hard. Sometimes harsh. Yeah, like life. Sometimes, <laughs> yeah. sometimes you're up, sometimes yeah, you're down. Yeah. But it, it's this to me means a flow. Flow. So it's flowing, through, flowing through a, a booklet mm -hmm. as you turn the page. Turn the pages. Yes. I think the also the painter used the, the 
time, like afternoon. Mm -hmm. No, when the, the, the sky began, like to, to sunset, no? and uh, the sky became more this color, which actually is the color, it gives you more comfort, more give you some peace, no? The, the this like a... The light? You know, mm. like a ole, no? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> and then, yes, bring you kind, poor, poor kind, make, make kind of balance, no? Mm -hmm. Okay, outside it's a uh, uh, storm, look, uh, so uh, much uh, strong, but behind of that, that it's hope. You, it's, you, you're inside home, you can see uh, beautiful colors, please relax, you know? <laughs> it's kind of thing like Oh, that. sweet. <laughs> no, I actually agree. I was thinking, you know, if this whole thing had a gray or a black background, it would have a much which harsher... Actually, it's uh, real, no? Right, we, right. We, Because we come from the winter yes. uh, and we see the, 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 the sky mm -hmm. is not like that, no? Right, right. Yeah. And it would feel a bit more like an art piece of yeah. hardship. Whereas the, the warmer background kind of, you see that yes, it's a, it's a long winter, but yeah. something about it just shouts strength to me. Mm -hmm. So when I look at this, I think it's beautiful and, and just full of representation for strength of whoever painted it or whatever wow. community it's part of, something like wow. that. Wow. Nice. Yeah. So. I see sadness. Oh. <laughs> so, that, yeah, it's open to interpretation. Yeah. I see yes. sadness. Thank you very much for sharing. So the artist, Mr. Yamamoto, uh, yes, took a, actually took, he, he used a camera to take pictures to observe things uh, and draw realistic pictures. So that's kind of modern too. Today was fantastic. It was a unique experience for me to to see all of these amazing uh, pieces of art, of Japanese art, and also sharing with my uh, the people I, I met today. Uh, interesting opinion and very interesting abordation of the, the 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 pieces of art. So I I definitely want to do that again with my friends coming here to, to, to see more pieces and spend more time. Actually, today I, I couldn't find when, I, uh, when the time was flying. <laughs> it was really uh, very attractive. How was it, everyone? Finally, I would like to introduce the National Museum of Modern Art Tokyo. The National Museum of Modern Art Tokyo is the first national museum in Japan located close to Tokyo Station. As I already introduced earlier, many works of modern and contemporary art, mainly Japanese art from the 20th century to the present, are on display. The collection includes more than 13,000 pieces. There are various genres of collections, and 15 important cultural properties are included in the museum and it is truly proud of Japan. You will find that many tourist spots are scattered around the area, and it is full of attractions such as the Imperial Palace and Kitanomaru Park. After visiting the museum, you can also enjoy sightseeing courses such as walking around the Imperial Palace and shopping in Marunouchi. Please make sure to stop by when you come to Japan. I'll be waiting. <laughs>